Funeral services were held today for Dave Schultz. And what really happened to cause the Sac County truck driver's death is still a mystery. The DCI says there is no evidence of foul play, while Schultz's family is seeking another autopsy to try to find some answers. What happened is the thing on the minds of many in the trucking community. WHO 13's Roger Riley has been near Rockwell City today where a trucker convoy has happened. Yeah, Aaron, this uh, convoy being led by Mitchell Reesgraff. He's the Iowa chairman of the Iowa CDL Drivers Unlimited. It's a trucker advocacy group. Their goal is to remember David Schultz. They want to remind the public and law enforcement that they want answers. And the issue of safety is a concern to truckers. It's definitely a cause for concern. We shouldn't just be disappearing mysteriously. But I think that we, with what we do for our country, we deserve the same due process as anybody else. It's some big dignitary or some big person in government, they're gonna pull out all the stops to make sure they find out who's responsible. Don't the men and women that deserve this country out on the nation's highways deserve that same treatment? I think so. Now, the truckers were from local firms, local owners. Uh, they had four big tractors and a pickup, so it was not a huge turnout, but people that were here were passionate about finding out what happened and paying respect. The message to, to the public is just, you know, watch what you're doing out there. Don't stop for anybody that don't you don't know or, you know, have lights on them. Make sure you get to a lit, well-lit area. If it's a cop, make sure you get to a well-lit area so that way, you know, you can see what's going on. Now the convoy will make a loop uh, from here at Sparky's on Highway 20 over to early in Rockwell City. Uh, they'll be doing that tonight until 8 o'clock. And meanwhile, I checked with the Sac County Sheriff, uh, Ken McClure. He told me via email that they are waiting until we receive a full autopsy report before we release any additional information. So obviously, everybody's waiting on some more information because right now what we have here doesn't make any sense how this all happened. No, very true. Roger Riley reporting live for us this evening. Thank you.